Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy IV. I almost said nine because that's my favorite, but this is four. Uh, I'm Private Chunky One, and we are going to do Act 18 of a 19 act game. So we are nearing the end. Um, in the last act, in Act 17, we uh, obtained the Lunar Whale, which is a airship that is capable of interstellar travel, and we went to the moon. On the moon, we went to a giant crystal fortress, and in this crystal fortress, we met the Lunarians. Lunarians are a race of uh, individuals who live on the moon. Well, we discovered that the man, the one who gave Cecil his power is actually his father, so Cecil is therefore a Lunarian. The man who is charged with guarding the Lunarians while they sleep because they are waiting for Earth to evolve to a point that the Lunarians can consider them equals, uh, they're sleeping until then. The man who is charged with guarding their slumber, his name is Fusoya. Fusoya has joined the party for the meantime, um, and although I've leveled him up, his stats will not go up, which is infuriating, but nonetheless. So, at the end of the act, I then proceeded to a cave to complete a side quest, which is to obtain Bahamut, the ultimate summon for um, Rydia, that's her name, uh, and I got him. The monsters in his cave ended up being a bigger challenge than he was, which was kind of comical, actually. So, I ended the stream um, and the recording, and I started power leveling. The amount of XP required to level my characters up now is insane, especially because I'm getting about twenty to 50,000 experience per party member from every monster I'm killing. Um, I did, however, do get some power leveling. I have a metric ass load of gold that I haven't touched, or gold gill that I haven't touched yet. And we are about to head back to Earth on the Lunar Whale to figure out something about Golbez doing something in the Tower of Babel. We'll get there when we get there. I'm not sure what's going on or what's going to happen, but I guarantee you it's going to be a hard ass battle. Um, although I do feel pretty confident in uh, my team's abilities and levels because Bahamut's cave was about 50 times harder than anything else I've done in this game. And I can now defeat any monster in Bahamut's cave except for one. It's this giant robot called an armored fiend. And if you watch the tail end of my last stream, uh, you'll understand. These things are impossible. Well, I finally got to the point where I could kill them. And lo and behold, guess what happens? They self-destruct if they get too low of health. So, you have to have a team that is so overpowered that you can nuke it before it self-destructs. I am not at that point yet, so I can't get the bestiary entry, so when I go back to do my second playthrough to get all the achievements, because you can't get all the achievements on your first playthrough, you have to do two. Um, when I go back to do my second playthrough, which will not be streamed because it's going to be a power run, um, I'm going to have to come back and kill this stupid robot, but tomatoes, tomatoes. Anyway. So let's get into what we're going to be doing today. Let me close that down. Let me open this up. And here we are outside of Bahamut's cave. Oh, I turned the music off while I was power grinding. So I could listen to my music. But I'll turn it back on now since I'm streaming. And it makes it a little less, like, quiet. All right, so this is the Lunar Whale. All right, we're going to drive this thing and go... Well, we're not going to drive it. We're going to go back to Earth. That's a nice boulder. What's going on? It's the Tower of Babel. We were too late. What? The giant has come. What giant? Does the tower itself become a giant? Oh no, a giant spawns from it. The 
That is the most petrifying thing I've seen today. And Golbez is controlling that thing, question mark? Holy shit. How am I supposed to beat that? No. This can't be happening. Is there anything we can do? What's that? Oh, what's that? Dwarves, we fight for the earth, our home, and for the and the mother of us all. Laliho! Oh, Yang! Yang, you should not be out here. You push yourself too hard. I'm fine, and even were I not, this is no time to be lounging in bed. Sid, too! The squad's back together! Hell yeah! Nothing to worry about now. Sid's here to help. All engines, full power. Sir! Dude, straight up. This is ballin'. Oh my god, they got revived? Hee <laughs> hee, did you miss me? Palam and Param are back. Our elder lifted the spell on us. This is not your burden to bear alone. This is a battle for all who live and breathe upon this planet. Dude, I've got chills. This is fucking... Edward's even in the ball game. Cecil, let me show you the courage you helped me find. This is fucking epic. I really hope I have a chance to run and get the Excalibur. They all came to fight. The giant, it staggered. Then this is our chance. We can get inside the accursed thing. Right, then we can slice up whatever controls it from the inside. We're going to need your help, Sid. No, no, no. I, I want to go get Excalibur before I go in there. I want to get Excalibur. Damn it. Take us to the giant's mouth. And who's this old white hair think he is ordering me about? His name is Fu Fusoya. He's from the moon. The moon? We've no time. Can you get us near enough to jump? Can fish swim? Well, who do you think you're talking to? Damn it, I'm not going to get a chance to grab Excalibur. I was really hoping I could get Excalibur. Well then, best hold on tight. Now's our chance. I'm in the giant's mouth. Damn it, I thought I was going to have a chance to go get Excalibur. Or heal, for that matter. I forgot to heal. Oh, it healed for me. No, it didn't. Radius not at max mana. I've just been... Alright, let's see how tough these things are. I'm okay with that. I'm not okay with that. Okay, that I'm fine with. I'm not too sure about what this big motherfucker is going to do, though. That might end bad. Oh, I need to change that to, to uh, Kiraga because Kira might not be enough. Well, we'll see how these first couple battles go. Okay, he did. Yeah, I'm definitely not worried about this if that's the most damage you're going to do to me. Bah yeah, Bahamut's Cave. Oh my god, I'm doing a shit ton of damage to these things. Bahamut's Cave was so much harder than this. But he does have a counter, note to self. So Cura is actually probably fine for now. Ah, oh, I don't know what that does. I don't like it. I don't like it. Ah, I don't give a shit. Never mind. Yeah, this is uh this is a uh, pretty easy right about now. This is a bit of a walkthrough. I hope there's something harder in here so I can get some real experience. Unless this thing's going to give me a bunch of experience, then I'm cool with that. And, well, you're dead. Uh, yeah, you're, you're dead. No, you're not. That's really annoying. He's weak to lightning, though, so I should have used Odin. I think Odin's lightning. Oh yeah. Oh, and I have um, I have over four hundred thousand gold or gil. So, Rydia grew to level seventy-one. Forgot to see how much. Uh, oh wait, experience. 
How much was it? I can watch it on my stream because it's 17,000 experience. That's not bad. Radio grew to level 71, HP to 2877, MP to 552, strength to 37, stamina to 35, intellect to 74, and spirit 55. That's actually not too shabby for as easy as a battle that, as that was. Okay. I gotta make sure I get all the maps in here because I'm willing to bet that when I take this thing down, um, there's, there's no coming back. Yeah, giant's neck map complete. That's really cool. Obtain three X potions. All right, where does this take me? Take me away, hi ho Silva, ho oh, hey! To the giant's chest. What am I like going to its feet? Boomer Shuriken, yes! I need to go buy some more of those too, but. Well, you're gonna die. If he summons the same thing... Oh, no, that's different. I don't know how I feel about that. Probably still not a challenge, but that thing has, like, sword arms, so it might be a little bit weird. Well, you countered the wrong guy, but okay. I guess, it, I guess uh, draw attack pulls it off of him. Mega Flare is going to do a shit ton of damage to those guys. Oh, oh, I can't damage him until I kill that guy. That's really irritating. Okay, I missed him. Okay, he didn't miss. Alright, yeah, I'm not worried about this. Okay, so while I kick this guy's ass, I'm going to run to the bathroom. Ah, wasn't a challenge after all. All right, I also have to do something real quick. I gotta change the uh, name of my stream because I'm no longer doing side quests. I'm doing Act 18. Done. All right, let's get back to it. All right, what's down this way? Uh, another chest. High potion. Oh, oh, well, that's a dragon. I wonder if I should be worried about this enemy. Beam is pulled by draw attack, so that's really cool. Okay, does it only hit him, or does... Yeah. So I have to make sure that I nuke him before... I don't like the sound of that. Okay, never mind. That was not... Ne okay, nothing in here is scary so far. I'm that overleveled. Man, this thing has more health than I thought it would. 
It's not going to live through that, though. Not much lives through Bahamut. Got a Heavenly Wrath. Cool. I got to make sure I get the bottom part of this map before I have to come back here. I'll be pissed. But if I don't get the treasure, uh, the treasure augment, because if you complete 100% of all the maps... Oh, this isn't good. If you complete 100% of all the maps, you get the augment treasure hunter. So on your when you start your second game, you get to keep all of your augments. Treasure hunter is so whenever you start your new game, you can get all of the items that you need to trade in for the best armor and weapons in the game, which are also um, achievements. So when I do my achievement hunting second playthrough, um, that's going to be... The main focus is having Treasure Hunter on um, Cecil, so no matter where I am, I can get the better items. Because it doubles the chance that you'll find the rarest item on an enemy. Which one of you does lightning damage? Okay, maybe it doesn't tell me because I haven't used that. But I'm going to use them and see if it'll tell me. Um, we're going to go back to auto battle now that I've selected what um, Rydia is going to do. I actually want to use Odin just to see because if Odin is lightning like I think he is then that would be very nice that, that guy actually does a decent amount of damage there in the back um, even when Cecil's defending but with prayer and cure I'm healing faster than he can damage no effect great So he is weak to lightning, but I don't know what the lightning summon is yet, because I don't know. Ten thousand experience. All right, so so far nothing in this area has been much of a challenge. So, uh, is this the way to go, or is oh no, good, it's just to complete the map. I don't know what that is. It's got a lot of armor. I'm going to have to change Fusoya to Kuraga to keep up with the damage from some of these team comps on the enemy side. Ah, uh, did a lot of damage. I'll take it. Only gave me 6,000 experience, though. That's kind of irritating. Soya, Cura, we are going to change this to Curaga. Siren, always good. Sirens are better when you're doing the uh, achievement hunting because they automatically call the enemy that has the rare item on them in the area to your attention. Got five remedies, that's always good. That's nice. That's the best arrow that she has right now, even though I'm not using her as a physical attacker. I'm using her as a healer. This will be a very short-lived battle. Bahamut's going to end this.
Bahamut summon is so cool looking. Also going to teach uh, Fusoya some of these augments, because that will help me with the achievement hunting. I guess he's going to get Analyze. And, I mean, Focus is kind of dumb to teach him, but I'm not going to put it on anyone else, so why not? And so now whenever he departs my team, I'll be able to get the rare augments off of him. Some of the augments, you get them by putting them on party members that will eventually leave your team. And when they leave, you get the augment. Oh, Soma drop. Uh-oh. Sword. Wait, wait, did I have more than one? No, I didn't. Okay. Soma Drop raises your max MP by 50, so I always put it on Rydia just so she can have a ridiculous amount of magic power. I really hope I get a heal off before he gets hit with another beam, because that could really fuck up my plans. That's a problem. Not that anyone needed it. The one who needed it's already dead. Don't die. Good. Oh, that did a lot more damage than I thought it would. Please don't hit him. Nope, she's not dead. She's good. Cecil. Goodness, that weakness does so much damage. Alright, so fighting two of these little beam thingies is actually a little bit of a problem. Never mind. There we go. Okay. Alright. Got a 10. Cecil grew to level 75, HP to 55, 72, MP to 335, Strength to 83, Stamina to 80, Spirit to 46. I'm curious. Yeah, I thought so. I have to go up that one first to get that treasure chest. This problem again. Well, I got Bahamut. I have enough mana for Bahamut this time, so... I don't think it'll be that much of a problem. Because once Bahamut rips, I'm going to nuke that party. damage, baby. Let's 
silver apple. That raises health. And I want my tank to be super tanky, so that's going to happen. How do you miss? How do you miss? He misses everything. This is why I wanted Excalibur, because Excalibur won't miss. Come on, stop missing. He should be dead five times over by now. That's two unanswered prayers in a row. That is rare. That's what I was waiting on. Daddy Bahamut says no. Giant stomach map completed. Got a dry ether. Yeah, baby. <clears throat> oh, that's wonderful. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt a wee bit. If her prayers keep going unanswered, this is going to be a problem, because I need that mana regen. There we go. That's better. Keep trying. You'll get there one day. Never mind. Daddy Bahamut said he doesn't want you to get there at all. Still not enough. You tried. I give you points for style.
Usaya. See, I don't care if he grows a level because he is worthless. Oh, what did I pick up? I didn't even see. Was it a key item? No. Must have been something I already have. Here's my save point, and here is Naming Way. Welcome! Oh, he wants to sell me stuff. Okay. We'll get some shurikens. So that way he can throw them instead of just regular attacking. I'm gonna buy fucking 99 of them. Why not? I've got the money. Uh, actually, no. I probably won't need that many because I'm about to unlock... Uh, I'm about to get the ability to buy the, the next ones, probably. I don't want to buy too many of them and then just unlock the next one and have to buy a ton of those. But abilities, edge, your thing is going to be throwing. Oh, wait, can I not make your thing throw? That's really stupid. I can't make his, his auto to throw. That's really dumb. That's upsetting. I'm going to use two tents instead of a cottage because I don't know when I'm going to need that cottage. This music is legit. you do? Yeah, you just sell me shit. Well, might as well buy 99 of these, because Rydia has the auto potion augment on her, and I have no potions to use, and it's a free 100 health, so why not? Tained Elixir. Inner stair. All right. Hey. Come. Where's there he is? I was wondering when he was going to show up. You again. Gifted us with life. To rob you of yours. Zemus. I yearn for this. Who when the fuck is Zemus? You taught me a great truth. That many are more powerful than one. I'll restore you to full strength. Oh, well, I didn't really need the tent then. Show us what power you possess. All right, all four of them. Oh, is it only one at a time? Oh, this might not be too bad. I need to remember... No, no, no. I need to remember what everyone... Um, no, 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 no. Uh, I think this guy's weak to fire. So let's see if Ifrit is, does the trick. Anything to steal off of him? Defend. Bless. Okay, enemy has no items. Pray. What's the damage look like? Yep, I was right on the fire count. And there was no counter, so that's good. Throw. 
shuriken. I don't want to throw the Fuma yet. Uh, defend. Summon. Ifrit. Edge is going to throw a shuriken. You are going to... You're actually going to be my dedicated healer on this one. Because you are going to start helping out with the whole damage game. Defend. Okay, if this guy only auto attacks, this is actually not too bad. Okay, so one down. He's weak to ice and thunder, if I remember correctly, so that's going to do nothing. Um, defend. Hold. Oh, that's annoying. Um, summon Shiva is ice damage. And you're just going to defend. While well, you're going to do... Oh, shit. Shiva healed him. All right. Change of plans. Oh, that's a problem. Heal up the entire party before the next onslaught of bullshit. Defend. Summon. Right there. It, Rama. Rama's the lightning one. Throw, shuriken, defend, black magic, thundara, wait, does he know thundaga, oh, thundaga, yeah, he does, that's what I selected, there we go, that's what I wanted, and there's the tsunami, so, so Edge is going to throw a shuriken. Um, you're going to defend. You're going to white magic Kiraja, everybody. You're going to summon Rama. You're going to defend again. Doesn't look like he does any physical attacking, though, so I should probably just hit him. He withdrew into his shell. You're going to hit him with... Dara. I forgot what withdrawing into his shell does, to be completely and totally honest. I forgot what that does. So we might learn a lesson the hard way right here. Row. Shuriken. Cecil, you're going to defend. I need Rosa again, because I'm going to cast a uh, shell on my entire... Okay, cool. Got it. Well, that doesn't do what I wanted it to do. Um, what was she weak to? I don't remember. Uh, shit. What was she weak to? Let's try Leviathan, because that might be the trick. Um, white magic. Oh, that's a problem. I need to get... Oh, good. Oh, no. It still hit a bunch of people. Where is... What is it called? Uh, shell. Where is Shell? There it is. Um, throw a shuriken. Wait, no, 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 no. He needs to defend. He needs to heal. Karaja, target all. That's going to be annoying whenever that person turns to fucking stone. Okay, did Leviathan do the trick? Yes, it did. Um, white magic. Raja. Um, Cecil is going to defend as usual. Did that hit everybody or just him? No, everybody. Okay, throw. Shuriken. Summon. Leviathan. White magic. Target all. As long as no one dies, I should be okay. 
defend. Okay, there we go. Throw. Shuriken. I'm saving that Fuma for uh, Barbisi, not Barbisi, uh, for Rubicante. White Magic, Kiraja. Okay, his missing shurikens is getting a little annoying. Throw. Alright, I need to... White Magic. Where is Insura? Where is Insura? Or Insuna, that's what it's called. Summon. Leviathan. Hold oh no, that's not what I meant to do. Um Row Okay, now we got a problem. White magic. Kiraja. Defend. Um, white magic. Oh god, this is gonna hurt. Oh, that actually didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would. Wait, what the fuck? Summon. Leviathan. Hit him. Defend. White magic. Kiraja. Heal everyone back up. And then you're gonna use item. You're going to use a gold needle to get him back on his feet. I healed him. Phenomenal. Okay, so what the fuck is he weak to? Does all magic heal him? Let's try Bahamut. Why the fuck not? Let's see what happens. Alright, let's steal from him. See if he has anything good. Enemy has no items. That's what I thought. Um, oh my god! He closed his robes. Shit. Cecil, defend. Fuck. Oh my god. He closes his robe if you steal from him. So I can keep him from doing Inferno. Gotcha. Okay, does that heal him? No, it does not. That's what I wanted to see. What I am... Oh, I have an idea. I have an idea. Um... You're just gonna you're just gonna steal every turn to prevent him from ever doing that shit. You're gonna defend. You're gonna summon Bahamut. And I have a fucking idea. I'm gonna put reflect on him. Okay, now he opens his robes. Steal. Um Defend. White magic. Where is Reflect? I'm gonna put Reflect on him so he can't heal himself after I hit him with. An Eidolon. Uh, you're gonna bless again because... Defend. Uh, you can pray because I don't need any like major healing at the moment and as long as I can keep him from using Inferno, he's useless. Yes, just keep stealing from him. Keep him from... Uh... Using that bullshit. Yeah! Yeah! Yes! I'm so happy I figured out that steel thing. Put that one in your back pocket for, for later. Twenty K experience. Edge got to sixty eight, uh HP to thirty four ninety eight, MP to two thirty two, strength everything went up one. Everything. I got defeated the Ar elemental arc fields. Fields. Fiends. Arc fiends. Lord Zemus! Yeah! We failed! Go away, turtle. Get out of here, wind lady. Not again. Demon spawn. A sound and thorough defeat.
Not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Magic. Rosa. Um, where is your... Kyora? Okay. So that was good teamwork. That was, that was excellent. Um, can I walk back to that save point and save? Apparently I can. Imagine how much easier this would be if I had Excalibur. Be stupid easy. Well, I say that, but it would probably still be a bitch and a half. Nothing else to be had here. Giant's Control Core. Oh, is there like a personal defense? This node controls the giant's operational systems. It's huge. <laughs> we must destroy the defense node first or it will repair damage to the core. Yeah, I gotta fight it. CPU. And two tagalongs. Oh, well, I'm going to get rid of the attack node first because I don't give a shit if it can heal if it can't do any damage. Um, white magic. We're going to put, because I already see this being a problem, we're going to put shell on the entire party. Yes, that's a problem. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. Where is shell? I hate when I can't find shit. It really makes me mad. There it is. Target all. Summon. Bahamut. Defend. Throw. Okay, this is who I'm going to use the Fuma Shuriken on. The attack node. And then White Magic, Kiraja. Get everyone back in the green. And then, um, you're going to defend still, you're going to throw the attack node, okay, yeah, yeah, just, you're going to throw, yes, alright, let's get rid of the defense node now, so can it, can it do... Oh, that was easy. Can it do any damage to me now that... Um, I'm actually not... Oh, shit! Yes, it can. Um, where's throw? Oh, fuck. Those are the only ways I had to heal. Because I forgot to buy Phoenix Downs. Regenerate. I'm okay with that as long as it's not doing damage. Oh. <gasps> That's a problem. That's a big problem. Hopefully Bahamut will nuke him because I don't know if I'll be able to without... <gasps> Damn it. It didn't target him because... And I don't have enough shit to do Bahamut again. Fuck. Well, I have to risk it. I have to risk it. Attack node. Do I have any items to bring them back? I don't have any Phoenix Downs. That's gonna hurt. I 
I'm hoping this does the trick. Okay. I need to use Bahamut again. I, I just... Oh, there we go. Only two people are getting experience, but I beat him. Whew. That was rough. Whew. Oh, I still got to beat this fucker? Shit. Well, I don't think he can actually do anything. Ah, okay. False alarm. I thought they were all going to die whenever I beat the middle one. 110,000 experience because everyone but two people were dead. Rydia grew to level 72, HP to 2907, MP to 572, strength to 38, stamina to 36, intellect to 76, and spirit to 56. Achievement unlocked. I defeated the CPU. It's done. The giant stopped moving. Something tells me I need to get the hell out of here in a hurry. You. Yep, Golbez. How dare you meddle in this? You. You're. Can you not speak, old man? Do, do you not know even know your true self? My true self. Awaken! What the hell just happened? N no. Why? Why was I so consumed by hate? You've regained your senses then. Do you... Do you remember your father's name? My father... His name was Kluya. <laughs> then you're... Cecil's own... Brother? Golbez is my... You were being manipulated... By the all-powerful will of Zemus. Your Lunarian blood rendered you an easy target for his curse, and bound your thoughts to his. To think Cloya's sons would be made to fight one another. Vasoya! I fought him. I hated him. My own brother. You are my brother. But... Were it me, the one Zemus chose to control, our roles might just as well have been reversed. No, there was evil in me long before all this. What? I'm the one who abandoned you. So I guess I'm not fighting Golbez? Cecilia, you did wonderfully, my love. <laughs> oh, that's Papa. He's a healthy little boy. Indeed, a gift from the gods. Theodore. Hmm? We'll call him Theodore. It's a boy's name. It means a gift of the gods. Theodore. That's a fine name. His life will be a blessed one. Theodore. Yawn. Oh, I get to play as Theodore. Uh, okay. I uh, don't get to press any buttons, though. And holy shit, I move fast. Where's father? He's still outside, most likely. Come now, back to bed with you. Okay, I have to go outside and find dad. Find father. There's no denying your father granted us convenience. He gave us magic and the means by which to sail the skies. Um, okay. Where's dad? If he, if we, it's we who use magic properly who look for the fool, who look the fools. What? Was that even English? Did I read that right? I probably didn't read that right. There's daddy. You're watching them again, aren't you? Oh, Theodore, you really like them, don't you? The moons? Yes, I do. Why? I'll explain it someday when you're old enough to understand. I am old enough. I can't I can even use magic already. You have mastered cure? Well, not yet, but then you've still some things to learn, haven't you? Come, it's late. You should be in bed. All right. Do I have to go back to bed now? I have to go back to bed, I think. 
That's not my house. Sorry, old man. Guess I don't have to go back to bed. Oh, mom's on the floor. What? Whoa, when did this happen? Mother, what's the matter? Don't worry. Don't. I'll be fine. But your face is so pale. That's because I've been working very hard. What do you mean? I have to make sure this little one will be all right. Who? Your little brother or sister. I'm going to have one? Yes. Yay, I'm going to be a big brother. Yes, so you had best go to sleep, hadn't you? An elder brother needs to set a good example. All right, good night. A little brother or a sister? Thanks, Stormer Sage. Never seen someone survive after taking both nodes down. GG. Kluya. You mean like they take the two nodes down and then they die from the following attacks? Father. It was the one who disagreed with his teachings. They they used magic. Kluya did not even raise an arm in his own defense. The Theodore. Father, are you all right? It's the first time I've played through this game, so I'm still trying to figure things out as far as that goes. Was I mistaken? Of course not. You can't choose how people use what you teach them. Thank you, Theodore. Father. No. no. Hold yourself together, Cecilia. Cure. And nothing happened. Theodore. N no. Wah, wah. It's a boy. I have a brother. Please, let, let me hold him. You mustn't strain yourself, Cecilia. Please. That's an ugly baby. Thank goodness. Mother? Did she just die? Mother! She knew the risk of this birth, and still she went through with it. Wham, wham. Well, they're gonna need a den, Mother. A vile thing, isn't he? That brother of yours? What? He's the root of all you've suffered. Who Who's there? If it weren't for him, your mother and father would both still be alive. No, you're wrong. And you are a vile little insect birthed from womb a, a dragon something. Stop. Stop, stop talking to me. What does he say? It went by too fast. Birth from womb of dragon's corpse are you. I mean you, Golbez. I name you Golbez. Is that? That's incredibly irritating is what it is. What is an infant doing in a place like this? What is it? It appears to have been abandoned, your majesty. The poor child. What is it, my liege? Cecilia. Your majesty? Forgive me, I am thinking I am thinking over much, and yet the resemblance is striking. The child's features, they remind me of very much of a person forced from Baron because of my cowardice. When, your, when our father died, I was left behind with our mother, who still bore you within her womb. The other villages, villagers cared for us at first. The people our father had blessed with lunar secrets, but our mother had become too frail and died shortly after you were born. I blamed you, telling myself our mother would have lived were it not for you. I took you, still an infant, to the forest at the edge of Baron and left you there. After that, I took to the borderlands. 
where I could hide from others' eyes. Racked by guilt, ashamed to show my face. I would not think to ask for your forgiveness now, but I am glad that you survived. What better a pawn could Zemus have possibly chosen than this? Where will you go? To put an end to all of this. Zemus is a Lunarian, as am I. I will go with you. Farewell, Cecil. Cecil, is this all right? That man, he means to die. He's your brother. My brother. Your blood. Your only living family. Oh, this isn't good. Cecil. We need to get out of here. But how? This way. Kane. We've fallen for enough of your tricks. We can talk later, but if you want to live, you'd best follow me now. Quickly. Giant goes down. My mind is my own again. I cannot expect forgiveness, but... Forgiveness? It's your fault the giant appeared in the first place! Stop it! Rosa. Golbez broke free as well. That's why you're free. None of this was your fault. So you're Cecil. Who are you? I'm Kane, Kane Highwind. My father is Sir Richard Highwind, the commander of the Dragoons. Pleased to meet you. Don't think you can be friends with me just because the king treats you like you're special. What did you say? Wanna fight, do you? What's a soft spoiled little boy like you gonna do to me? I'm not spoiled. Talk back to me, will you? Stop it. Rosa. Men of Baron fight not without just cause. That's what his majesty taught us, isn't it? But he's the one who... Dragoons don't make excuses. Hmm, I know that. I started it. You're an honest one, aren't you? See, it wasn't my fault. Hee <laughs> hee, I guess it wasn't. Golbez is Cecil's older brother. A Lunarian named Zemus was making use of Golbez's Lunarian blood as a means to control him. Golbez and Fusoya went to the moon to put an end to Zemus. Golbez was Cecil's brother? Well, in any case, it would seem I have a debt to repay Zemus too. Huh. And when he takes over your mind again? What then? If that should happen, kill me without a second thought. <laughs> then count me in too. I have a couple of blades with this Zemus's name on them. Edge. Let's go. To the moon. But Rosa and Rydia stay behind. This time, there may be no homecoming. Cecil, you can't no! mean that! No! I want my healer! Get off the ship. I need my healer! The fuck do you mean get off the ship? This is work for grown ups. What the fuck? Back here. Fine. <laughs> Cecil. They just got rid of the two best members of my party! Don't argue, Kane. The fuck, dog? 
What the absolute shit? All right. Let me go get Excalibur, because apparently I'm going to need it. No, I don't want to go to the moon. I want to go get Excalibur, you shithead. Um, can I head to the moon and then turn back around? Ugh. That's infuriating. Literally just got rid of my highest damage dealer and my healer. Why would I fight against Zemus without my highest damage dealer and my healer? That's infuriating. Off to the moon. Excuse me. Step aside, Rosa. I'm not going anywhere. Why not? Without me along, who will heal you when you're hurt? Thank you. Listen to the voice of reason. The voice of reason. You can't win this one, Cecil. No use arguing with a woman. Then I'll argue no more. Your help is welcome. Just as we planned. You're here too? This battle is good as much as anyone. Cecil says good. himself. And having some idolons along can't hurt, can it? No, not at all. They're welcome. They're welcome to fucking come. Come. Our battle awaits. Okay, now I got the squad. Now, can I go back to Earth and get my shit? I do not want to fight this battle. Thank you. I do not want to fight this battle without getting my Excalibur. Okay. So I need to buy a bunch of shit. What the hell am I doing? I'm going to fly this way. Wait, wait. No, it's up here. But I have to... I'm stupid. I'm sorry. I'm I'm stupid. Can I pick up the hovercraft with this with this one? No. Okay, so I have to set this one down. Cause I need the hovercraft to get to Wait a minute. No, I don't. I am so dumb. Can I get to the can I get to the underworld? Can I get to the underworld in this ship? That's the question of the day. Well, let me go through the portal. So I think it's still a giant gaping hole in the ground. Yes. Oh, it won't let me in this ship. Damn it. I got to go get the other ship. I need the ship that can pick up the hovercraft or that can go to the underworld. Is this it? I think this might be it. Where's my... Okay, there's the other one. I don't know which is which. No, this isn't it. This is the original one. I need the Falcon. I'm pretty sure it's going to make me get the Falcon. Wait. Oh, yeah. This one can go down there, but it can't cross the lava. I need the Falcon because it can cross the lava. The magma pools. Forge so I can get the Excalibur and actually have really good ass weapons. And also, I'm gonna have to do some buying because now that I have Kane, I need to make sure that he's equipped properly. Where are you at, bud? The Hallowed Blade Excalibur, may it serve you well. Tamed Excalibur, Baruf.
For form reborn. All right, let's check this weapon out. Cecil. Oh my god, that's excellent. Um. Alright. Wait, what does this guy do? Oh, yes! Excellent! Those are expensive as hell! Oh, you get bulk pricing. That's kind of funny. God damn, those are expensive. I did not think it was going to be that bad. Alright. So, I've got a couple Fuma Shurikens now, just in case shit goes super wry. Now we're going to go back to the Dwarven Castle, and I'm going to see if they have anything that I can buy. I think the Dwarven Castle is where the best gear is available. But I have to go to the bathroom again. I'll be right back. I am back. Let us see. I think it's over this way. Is there anything else that I can buy? No. What about armor? Nope. Oh, see, that's why he... Uh, uh, Edge gets hit so hard by magic. He has zero magic defense. All right, y'all. Well, that's the end of Act 18, but I am going to continue streaming to get through Act 19, which is the final act in the game. Um, but I got to cut the recording real quick so I have an end point and then reintroduce for the next one. So give me like two minutes to do that. You can sit here and watch me because I'm not cutting the stream. But yeah, so for this recording, um, remember... You can always follow me on Twitch to know when I'm streaming or on Facebook and you can get updates and also make requests on games that you would like to see me stream. I've gotten requests for Diablo, Starcraft, um, well there's another big one in there, I can't remember what it was. I've gotten stuff like CSGO and I stream League of Legends every now and then, I stream Civilization every now and then, Total War, um, stuff like that. Uh, but if you have any requests for any throwback games you want me to play, then just throw it up on Facebook or throw it up on my fiance's Colin. Throw it up on Facebook or throw it up on 
uh, YouTube, you can subscribe to me on YouTube. Anything you miss in the stream will be uploaded onto YouTube, so you can just watch it there. Um, and remember, I'm doing a giveaway for Final Fantasy IV. Whenever I complete the game, I'm going to do a drawing sometime within like a week of it. And in to get entered into that raffle, you make a comment in the uh, chat box for Final Fantasy IV for the, the, any of the time that I stream it. And you get a raffle ticket into the drawing. Uh, I will stream the drawing so you guys can come and watch that. It'll be lots of fun. Uh, but in the meantime... Private Chunky One, out.